This is your reminder today that if results are too slow, you haven't been able to get to as many sessions as you'd like to or do the food plan that you'd like to have, giving up, quitting, throwing in the towel won't make you get results any faster. Sometimes we start the year with all these expectations, exercise this many days, make sure I get this food plan in, and because we're not hitting it, we think we might as well give up. But actually, this is just great feedback that we need to switch our expectations to reality. Maybe we've got some data and it's not gone fast enough. We've done this and we're not getting results. Maybe it's our expectations. If you're losing 0.5 to two pounds a week, keep going with that. Keep going, it's probably actually doable and you're probably enjoying it as well. And then if you're enjoying it, it's sustainable, why would you even give up? And that's one of the key questions people get where they do lose weight. People can lose weight, they just can't keep it off. Equally, you might go, you know, I'm doing this, I'm not losing weight. Okay, can we increase your exercise? Can we increase your daily movement, your steps? Can we make sure that we look at your protein intake a little bit more? It's great when you fail, it's great when you have obstacles, it's great when you struggle, because if you have a look at it, what you're doing, all of that does is feedback. What do we need to change then? We've got this data, this isn't working for you. What could we tweak instead? That's how you build a personalized diet for you. That's how you build a personalized training plan for you. Rather than going, oh, it's not working for Emma to actually that will slow everything down and you won't get any faster results. Like we want faster results, so we give up. That just slows everything down tenfold. I know it sounds really obvious, but when you say it out loud and listen to it, it puts things into context.